Well, it's Friday late afternoon. Taking a break from work. Gonna run do trail cameras, check on food plots. Had to pick Cruz up from his first day of football practice. So I was right here in town. So I thought I'd stop and uh, see how things look. So I'm gonna change camera cards here while I'm out here and then uh, check on the food plots. It's been uh, six days since I filmed this plot. Uh, we definitely have some good growth. Yeah, there's some weeds coming up in it, but well, it's kind of to be expected, but otherwise it looks like it's growing pretty good. I don't know how much you can see, it gets picked up on the camera, but a lot of growth in here. Uh, we had decent rain this past week. And uh, hopefully that rain uh, with some sunshine keeps this, uh, keeps this growing. So we'll uh, keep changing cards here and uh, check out the other plot. I had a thistle patch here. Uh, that we hit with glyphosate to finally just kill it. I threw some, just threw some winter rye in here. Just threw it on the ground to see if it would grow and uh, I don't see anything growing yet. Huh. Like nothing. So I guess we'll see if it takes. It's been uh, six days since we did that. So it might be too early yet. Um, it was just... Uh, was literally just a thistle patch that I burned down um, with glyphosate. So I guess we'll see what uh, if anything grows. So also six days ago, uh, we sprayed my bean plot with uh, glyphosate. These are Roundup Ready beans. Um, we had to kind of get creative and hand spray it. I got most of it. Uh, I'll do a quick uh, pan around here. As you can see, uh, a lot of it's starting to turn yellow, so hopefully that works. Um, it was interesting hand spraying it. We used the hand sprayer off the ATV. I had crews drive around the edges. I pulled the hose out as far as I could, put the nozzle on uh, the single stream and sprayed and sprayed and sprayed. So I don't know. We'll see if it. Uh, we'll see if it worked. Let's see what we got going on down here. Had just a little washed out spot down here. This just happened naturally from the flood. So I threw some of my winter mix in here and by golly, it's growing, growing real good. I think I got a bunch of grass in here too, but that's all right. Looks like she's growing. So I'll uh, keep changing cards and we'll uh, look at the other plot. Well, it looks like grandpa got this plot mowed. Uh, he had to use the little 212 John Deere lawnmower to get it. Um, this thing had been so wet for so long. It's actually, you can see right where the ruts were, where I'd gotten the tractor stuck. Um, so I guess the next question is, should we till this up and throw something in it yet? Uh, we ain't got much time, but uh, I guess I better do some thinking quick. Well, it's Sunday now and we're just getting ready to uh, leave the land. Uh, we just spent a couple hours getting plots ready. Uh, we came up with a plan for this one. Grandpa Kevin got it all mowed down real nice. Um, we got some rain last night and that got it a little bit wet, but I ran over it uh, this morning uh, with a sprayer, sprayed it with uh, glyphosate to kill the uh, chicory, clover, and weeds that were in it. And then uh, I just went over it with a drag to kind of open it up a little bit. Um, and we're gonna throw some uh, turnips, uh, radishes, and I think I'm just gonna throw some winter rye in the mix. And this one, uh, we're going to do that here in a couple hours. I got to go grab some seed. We're going to get planted and I'll go uh, shoot a video quick of the other plot that we worked on today. Well, this plot here is going to be a little bit of a challenge. Uh, it's been two or three years since we've tilled it. Uh, we had uh, probably three years ago, we planted some buck forage oats in it. Um, and they ran for a couple of years and kind of petered out. And then this spring, it was way too wet. 
uh, way too wet to get in it and now it's the middle of august it's finally dried out uh, my dad grandpa kevin got it uh got it mowed down yesterday saturday So you can see you got it mowed down. Um, I ran over it today, uh, sprayed it with glyphosate, and then uh, I ran the drag over it just to kind of try to knock it down. Not really sure what is going to happen with this. There's a lot of vegetation here. Um, but we are going to try to throw some winter stuff out here. I'm uh, going to try to throw some turnips and uh, radishes out here as well. And uh, call to pack them down and spray it again with glyphosate. And I guess we'll see what happens. Oh, we're going to throw some winter rye out here too. So we got a nice big spot here. It's right along the road. But uh, if it works, we'll have some good winter food. But it's hard to say if it's going to work because there's a lot of vegetation here. So uh, we'll jump back here. Once we uh, get it seeded, uh, I'll shoot some more. Well, we've got seed, so here we go. We're going to get this one planted and uh, the other one planted yet tonight. Well, that's a wrap. I uh, stopped filming. Um, I just hurried up and got done. We were running out of day um, so everything is planted uh, now i just need some rain and uh, we'll see if the uh, seed takes <laughs>